Good morning guys, uh, it's 5.30 a.m. Just made up some peanut butter and jellies for lunch. Uh, last night Connor bought a first gen uh, Cummins and I'm definitely very jealous. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that's what I've been saving up for and that's what I really want to get. <clears throat> Because I need a vehicle of my own, and if I could convert it to biodiesel, that would be sweet. So, um, yeah, 5.30 right now, I'll be off to work in half an hour, and I'll probably see you guys maybe during work today. It depends on uh, what we're doing and where we'll be, and if I'm driving, etc., etc., but I'm sure I'll see you guys later today. I have a lot of stuff that I need to jam in at the end of the day, so. Okay, I got home late today. It's like six o'clock right now. I just walked in the front door. Um, we worked just right across the street over at the Performing Arts Center at La Crosse. We pretty much finished the whole roof today, started and finished today. And the awesome thing <clears throat> about working there is it's cons considered a state job. So rather than getting my normal $15 an hour, I was actually making, I'm not totally sure what it was, but it was either $22 or $32 an hour. And I found out that yesterday, since I was working over on the, the building, I think that also counted as state hours. And tomorrow we're gonna be working on the building. So that that will count as state hours. So I'm, I think this week's going to be a pretty big paycheck. And <clears throat> I also think that because yesterday when Kevin and I worked together, we worked all day, but the other crew stopped at like 2 o'clock. So Kevin and I got in a full day, and the other crew only got in, you know, whatever, three quarters of a day. So on Friday, they're gonna have to work some more hours and they will only get their 40 hours, but Kevin and I will get overtime. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have the state hours on top of my normal 40 hours on top of overtime hours. So uh, this, I'm, I'm kinda excited to see what my paycheck is for the end of this week. I get paid weekly. Uh, so yeah, hopefully, <clears throat> Hopefully it'll be a nice sum. Um, yeah, I'm eating right now, and then gonna head on out, meet Caitlin at the parking ramp. We'll probably go for a little bit of, walk, of a walk. She probably will be ashamed to be walking with somebody who looks like this, and then um, I think she has a phone that I can use for a little bit to activate. I don't even know if I'm gonna activate it, honestly. Like. My phones have been all over the place. It was really nice of them to bring it, but I just, oh my God. it'll be like the fourth or fifth time I go to the US Cellular if I actually do activate it. Um, and last but not least, the gym tonight. I don't know, I was gonna go, I wanna go, I still wanna go, but everybody in the house who I would normally go with already went and I know that because I was working on the roof right out there and I was watching him go to class all day and uh, I'd wave you know and then I saw him all go to the gym at like whatever 3 30 and it's now six o'clock they've been done for quite a while so I would be going to the gym by myself and I don't always feel comfortable um, performing some of the workouts by myself and especially without a spotter so uh, we'll see when I get back and it's already late and if I go for a walk whatever excuses but um, yeah I'll keep you updated I need to finish eating and then go for this walk okay so I went with the uh, well I guess it wasn't a walk Caitlin and I just drove around we went to Pettibone uh, like sort of swamp Mississippi runoff beach area uh, saw a big old raccoon, he climbed up a tree, we got out, shined our flashlights up, saw him, and <clears throat> picked up the pink 5C phone from Caitlin, it's sitting on my bed right now, probably, maybe, gonna activate it tomorrow, we'll see how I'm feeling, 
I'm doing fine without a phone so far, so, um, but it would be nice so I can call uh, the electrician people and start to find out some more stuff. Uh, like I predicted, did not go to the gym, unfortunately. Uh, I feel bad. <laughs> I wish I did. But, it, like I said, it's hard without a spotter. It's hard to do stuff, and it's hard when I'm new to it. I don't know everything. Um, and then, yeah, I think that's about it. I just showered, done showering. You can probably tell by my hair. You can probably tell every time uh, after I shower, my hair's always sticking up now. Um, <clears throat> and going to bed, waking up early tomorrow, uh, just because I want to. I'm liking waking up early, and then I'm gonna go over literally just right across the parking lot to the Performing Arts Center, and we're gonna start at seven and work over there again tomorrow. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys, I think I'm gonna call it uh, the end of the vlog today. I don't have too much more to share because um, I'm pretty much just gonna go to bed. So I hope you guys liked the vlog today. Um, if you did, feel free to like, subscribe, share, comment, all that good stuff, and I will see you guys tomorrow morning.